against Russia, who had the comments during the country's annual Victory Day celebrations. Supporters of Pakistan's former Prime Minister Imran Khan come with police in Lahore. The ex-cricketer was arrested earlier for appeared in court on corruption charges, which he denies. He was bonded into a home by riot officers in his Dr. Fazal Shah was an expert in Indian politics, says the public do, but... place, some action has been taken. Yeah. It became something of a running joke, to be honest, that every time he showed up in court, waiting for the trial to commence, no, I need to get he was condition. given bail. Uh, with many people um, feeling that this was really uh, all uh, a facade. Ministers believe new measures for farmers in England could free up to 15 million GP appointments over the next two years. Chemists will be able to give out antibiotics, contraceptive pills and other medicines without doctors needing to sign. In the city, the FTSE 100 closed down 14 at 7764. The pound buys $1.26 and one euro fifteen. Sleep, policeman. Oh! Otherwise, dry with some clear spells, but showers will move into the west later on. On the 7 degrees, no showers spreading from the west to most areas tomorrow. Some sunshine in the south. Here we are in Aloha. From Global's newsroom. As the Aloha. I was watching an ex cop going on about dodgy cars the other day. It was quite it was really funny. I'll need to watch the video again. And uh, in the list was the Subaru Impreza. <laughs> he was talking about the cars that in West Yorkshire they had to like chase with the police before he retired. And then Subaru, there's a Subaru Impreza alongside me right now, but you can't see it because I can't, I'm not supposed to touch the phone. But. It. You might see it. You'll p you should pull away before me. Ah, uh, damn it, no. Shit. Ah, oh, okay, sorry, you kind of see it. There's a Subaru Impreza. Was he said that they were brilliant cars, like they're new and everything, but after a few years they became slightly faked up. You know, like wrecked. As in wrecked and knackered. I think Allo is a lovely town, yeah. Allo is a great place. It's kind of like missed out a bit, I suppose. I've been trying to talk about council schemes and what I miss about them. And what what I think I miss about them is they're full of life. Life. I know they're full of trouble, I know. Uh, they're also full of life get people doing all sorts of things. You can get real genuine people in council schemes. But the more better off places are a bit more snotty. And people that they've got money and the the more they'd be more standoffish I suppose. More careful, which is which is you know understandable, you should be careful. So in the council scheme, you've got all sorts of stuff going on. There's tragic people in them as well. People who are just never going to... It's all relative, because the wealth that they have is all relative to, you know, Alloa Town Hall. No, not to Alloa Town Hall, it's relative to their situation. And there's a limit to what they can be, but that doesn't mean that, that, you know, that they're not good people or they're not living a good life. They can live a good life. Having like, money in them doesn't mean you're a better person. It means you're a better off person. And it means you've got better options. Uh, that's basically what it is. You know? But now I've had to think about things a lot. It's not just me, but I suppose everybody has, but what I have got to think about is I think this car needs a wash.
was a nice, quite a nice town. You know, it's like, yeah, I'd, quite, I'd be quite happy living here. It's probably better than where I live. I live in Stirling. Stirling's a bit more snotty. You know, I think I think I've got a problem that, um, maybe I've got an internal gypo inside me. <laughs> like I've always wanted to be a gypo. And <laughs> you haven't always what are you talking about? Oh uh, yeah, I've always wanted to be a traveller. So it's like it's a kinda like a resentment of me or where I am and want to be somewhere different. It's a cantankerous personality trait, that's what it is. You know, where you just you just want like so you make it big and then you want to be you don't want to be big anymore, you want to be living in a fucking cardboard box somewhere, you know? So it's like, it is an irritating kind of personality trait, you know? That, that you want to, you know... So you get somewhere and you want to be where you were before, you know? So it's like, it's an irritating personality trait for sure, yeah. There ain't no doubt about that. Definitely. So here we are. So I hope you enjoyed that video. Because here we are. We are in Aloha. And lovely, there's lovely gardens up there. I actually want to have a look up there. There's the DS5. Wow. So on that note, thanks for watching, bye!